Typically, when you deal with applications which integrates document management components, you generally see two types of components. One is an upload button. You click on the upload button. You choose a file upload. As simple as that. The second one is you see a list of files. Next to that, you see a download icon and click on the download to download the file and show you. Sometimes it also shows the picture on the screen, right? So it's an image viewer. So instead of actually clicking on a download button, you actually see that image on the screen. Now, did you know, depending on the type of the file, for example, if it's the image, you can see image viewer. If it is a video, you see video viewer. If it's a PDF, you see PDF viewer. So there are numerous ways you can actually display the original file on the browser. Now some people think, hey, I can display image, I've seen it, but can I display PDF? Yes, you can display the PDF. You can display multiple PDFs on the same page. What else? Can I display Word document, Excel document? Can you? Yes, you can. We will read them. And I want to categorize all these under the umbrella of document visualizers. It's much more than Word documents. Sometimes you want to display text files, template files, source code. There are many types of documents you want to display differently. And how you build a sophisticated, modern, adaptive document visualization tool by yourself, custom tools. It's going to be an interesting journey. Stay tuned. For more videos on this topic, please subscribe the channel.